Uh, so you're probably wondering, how did I flip my Porsche? Well, uh, quite simple. See, Carter's not here for the next week. I decided to just hijack his crib. Or his tiny cars. This is the world's fastest, smallest car! Today I'm doing a challenge with this like I've never done before! I'm doing a last stop driving challenge inside the team warehouse with this tiny mini car. See if I can even get inside. This is about to be so sick! Oh, dude, this is sick! Oh, I've actually made it in the house right now. I'm in the team warehouse with the tiny car, and there's also a bigger car. Okay, we're gonna go check that out, but I gotta figure out how to get past these corners without hitting the walls, y'all. Really difficult, but luckily, we have reverse, which allows us to straighten out and go backwards, put it in forward. I can probably get this corner now. Ready, three, two, one. Woo -hoo! Look how tight. Those corners are, look at that edge. Oh, oh my gosh, I don't know if I'm gonna make it. Just about got by and, oh, dude, I am way too close. Go in reverse, behind me, I think we're good. Perfect, and forward again. Now we do a hard left. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. We are cutting the corner sharp, literally close. Look at that. Oh, we just made it, yes! Now we're officially in the tiny car in the Team Our House. Look at this. Hang out and do whatever I want. This is so fun. Oh, I just hit the couch. That's not good. Let's go reverse. Come on. Dude, this thing sometimes doesn't work. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Ah! If I ran into that glass door, Carter would have been so mad. Anyways, I'm getting kind of hungry, so I'm going to go see if I can actually fit in the kitchen. Let's go. Remember, y'all, if y'all like these tiny cars, hit that subscribe button. Let's get it. And also, don't forget to like the video. It's not every day you get to see someone drive a car in a house. I mean, come on, this is so cool. So we got ourselves a little problem. The food is behind me. The, I don't know if I can fit through there. So we're gonna have to loop all the way back around and go head in first. You definitely don't see this every day. This is honestly the funnest challenge I've done in a long, long time. One issue, the fact this is a tight, tight turn. I'm not, I don't know if I'm able to make this right now. And there's an air vent. Okay, well, y'all know I'm not allowed to leave this tiny car because I'm not gonna stop driving it. I'm not losing the challenge today. So let's look around. We have a good amount of real estate here, as y'all can see. I have this seat as well I can stand on, which makes this a lot better because I don't just wanna be sitting down in there the whole time just driving. In fact, look how big this tiny car is. There's a lot of space. And with that being said, I have to try to fit through this tight corner right here. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it, but I guess we have no other option. We're just gonna go for it, three, two, one. Ooh. Ooh, look at the mirror. The mirror does not barely make it. Oh, dude, we are burning out on something. I can't see really underneath, but I know we don't have a lot of space, so I don't think I can loop all the way around. I think I'm just gonna have to reverse here and figure out how to get the food going that way. If you don't know what a three-point turn is, it's pretty much where you have to turn three times to turn around. So now we're gonna try to go Forward, whoo, almost hit my phone. And then we're gonna go backwards, just tap the gas, kind of a lot. Back forwards again, backwards again. At this point, it's looking like a five point turn. Honestly, I'm not doing too hot right now, but I think we just made it perfect. Look, we are just squeezing by, and y'all, I am starving. I mean, look at me, I need food. We're gonna go right now, and uh, we're gonna pick some up in my little red car that I'm driving around the Seymour house. <laughs> Who would ever thought that we'd be whipping these around the property and also inside this entire mansion? It's so crazy. Now it's time to see if we can fit between this. This is where it gets sketchy, because these are all glass. So if I hit that and it breaks, that's not good. So we might not even be able to fit, so let's check it out. Ooh, it's a tight squeeze on that side. How about this one? Ooh. Oh, mate, I, I honestly don't think I'm gonna make it just because of the side view mirrors. Look at this. If this could pass it, then probably I would go in. But look at this. I'm just gonna inch it a little for y'all. It just barely actually made it. Look at that. Okay, that's crazy. This side, though, it's definitely gonna hit. So honestly, that's not manageable. But I just thought they're gonna be. Probably food in the fridge. Let's check there first. So if I want to check the food in the fridge, I'm gonna have to back up to it. And clearly this is a lot harder than it looks. I'm telling y'all, this is not the easiest thing to do. I'm filming one hand, shifting gears in the second hand, and then turning and yeah, it's a lot. I feel like I'm truly driving an actual car right now. Woo! That was actually really fast just now. And one last time. 
right, let's back it on up. Let's see if this is gonna work for me. And boom, perfect. I love Ohio, we'll open the fridge. Oh, this is awesome. Woo, okay, we got the tiny car right here and we got the fridge here. What should I get from the fridge, y'all? I mean, we have water, we have coffee, we have sodas. There's a lot of options. What? Look at all of this. Sadly, that fridge in there has a lot more options, but I'm not allowed to leave this car right now. I'm gonna be driving it all throughout the team of our house, which means I have to just take with what I have here. So I'm gonna go with just a nice little water. This challenge is a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. But with that being said, the journey must continue. Now that we have our drinks, I need to figure out how to get some food. And, oh, wait, what is that? Is that some bananas? I didn't know that there was a fruit tree hanging inside the team warehouse. Hold on, where's Ford, where's Ford? All right, we're gonna gas it right now. I need to go get a banana. I'm starving right now. All right, put it in reverse. Oh man, I'm telling y'all, this is exhausting right now. Driving this car all around the house may look really fun, but it's definitely tiring. Back to forward. <sighs> Mate, I'm so hot right now. It is very, very, very scorching hot in this Team Raw house right now. I don't know if y'all can see me sweating, but I'm definitely sweating. And forward, and let's go. Perfect. Nice little lake view, give it a wave. Not that that matters or anything, but we have now made it officially to our banana tree right here. Oh, finally, I've been waiting all day for this. Oh, no. Dude, they're all like peeled and gross and uh, whatever, we're just gonna eat it anyways. Cheers, bottoms up. All right, well, not gonna complain. Food is food. And we have some banana down the hatch. Woo! Who would ever thought after drinking that water, eating that banana, I would be so tired? Well, to be fair, I might need to find somewhere to take a nap because, man, I'm telling you, driving this little tiny car is actually exhausting. I'd much rather probably be driving that thing. I'd probably be more energized if I was, but I'm not. Um, what do you think about that, Curtis? I think that's great, man. What about you? Dude, it's awesome. Oh, Curtis, y'all shouldn't have. All right, well, we're just gonna keep on driving this thing around. I mean, I just wanna gas it nonstop and do an entire lap without letting go of the gas pedal, kind of like I'm doing right now. But taking these sharp turns is gonna make it a lot harder. Oh, no, no. <gasps> Dude, I don't know where the brake is and I almost didn't be able to brake and I was about to hit that and break the wall, pun intended. I think it's only fair to wake myself up. I should do a full speed test all the way down the strip to the end of the hall to Carter's room. I think that would be great. In fact, look at this. We have a sport mode, which makes this thing go twice as fast than what it was doing before. We're just gonna rip it full speed down the hallway. We're gonna see actually how fast I can go in this tiny car, y'all. Isn't that insane? We're gonna go full speed right now. In three, two, one, go! Oh, oh let's go! Dude, I'm flying! I'm going five, six, seven! I'm going 10 miles per hour! I can't believe this is happening! <laughs> the best day of my life. I'm having such a fun time in this tiny car. Like, what are the odds that someone comes home and kicks me out for doing all these crazy activities? Oh, oh my gosh, I almost just fell out. That was super sketch. And also, you know what's even crazier? My water bottle stayed still the entire time when I flew down that hallway. Wow. Oh, but I will say all that racing and food I ate is making me tired. So with that being said, whoo. We're gonna figure out exactly where I'm gonna post up to take a nap. And I'm kind of thinking, maybe I go in the Lambo, it's bigger. I know the challenge today is the last leave the tiny mini car, but I could go over and switch into the Lambo. Actually, I can't, this is too small of a gap. Hmm. All right, well, we might just have to post up over here. And honestly, y'all, if this video gets 2,000 likes, I will do this challenge with the entire Team Roar. Uh, so you're probably wondering, how did I flip my Porsche? Well, you see, it's uh, quite simple. See, Carter's not here for the next week, and uh, I decided to just hijack his crib. 
I guess I went too hard.